Yo, what's up, y'all? You know what it is. It's fucking what? Monday, Monday, like we do every time at this time, 8 o'clock, 8 to 10, bsideshow.net. Make sure you tell your peeps. We got guest DJ, DJ Prospect in the building, man. What up, Prospect? What up, son? Go. He's Go. all just looking at us. You can grab, you can talk. It's okay. DJ's oh, no, allowed to talk, bro. It's cool. That's cool. What's up, man? What's cracking a pimp? Nothing just much, chilling. man. What you what you uh, what you been up to lately, dog? Man, just working right now with uh, F- uh, Freeway Enterprise. You know, doing the new American Gangster feature film coming out pretty soon. Yeah, shit. that's right. Nice. Denzel Washington and shit. Production. Yeah, just working on the music for the, you know for, right. for the movie. I, I thought you were Denzel stunt double. Yeah, for the that's, part. that's exactly. I'm, I'm not <laughs> yeah. <doing> shit. Yeah. <laughs> hey, hey, Freeway Ricky. And yeah, shit. yeah. There you, <laughs> go. You, know, you know what I mean? Hey, well, that's what's up. But you've been doing a lot of production, right? Yeah, yeah. Just doing making beats and all that. We're gonna talk about that throughout the show and put right. up the link and all that stuff so the people could get at you. So. Shout out to everybody who's in the chat room right now. Hey, do you have any idea? We have a quick mix at the beginning, as you know, but. Uh, and then the other mix at the end. Do you have any idea what you're going to play today? I or? have no idea what I'm going to play, man. I'm just going to play. So that means it's going to be good music. Yeah. yeah. yeah, <laughs> yeah everything's, no. ha- everything's handpicked for me, you know, so it's all. Yeah, go on, go on by feeling, man. That's what yeah, it I'm is, man. It. Shout out to the, we got a lot of people in the building today, man. Greenhouse Projects, man. Bare Arm yeah. Clothing. Yeah. Pause one, Mr. Shit on Your Porch is in the building too, man. Yeah. That's what it is, man. <laughs> Pause Uno, the homie right there. Hey, but, uh. What else? What's up for the weekend, man? I mean, this weekend that just passed the event. How'd that go? Because you filmed it. Oh man! For those yeah. that don't know, we had a, a bike crew um, come through here. The '86 Fixie Bike Crew. How many was there? About 15, 20 well, there total. Was a, there was a few cats who were just they're just all Fixie riders, man. It was cool, and they came through over here, and uh, you know had Zion spinning up in the front and stuff like that, and then they went ahead and started from here. Actually, they came from Pomona, rode over here. Did a smoke break and then they rode back to Pomona. It was pretty dope, though, man. It was really cool. Yeah, so they did. They had to. G- they got it in even on a bike ride, man. How, m- how long was it? What, like ten miles? You know I what I'm saying? Say so, hey, you know the trip the, right at the end when they were getting to the gallery because after that there was a gallery and then we're all at uh, the downtown over there, man. The art walk stuff like that. It was pretty dope, man. Had a good time and stuff. Saw a lot of people haven't seen it in a while. But one of the bikers was cutting across. And he almost got run over by like a suburban and stuff like that, man. <laughs> oh, it would have been a great viral video. He was too lifted. To he was too <laughs> lifted. <laughs> uh, it was crazy, dude. We thought he was going to get hit. He almost got lifted off the ground and yeah, shit. You know what I mean? Crazy, hey, but shout out to them for coming through. Um, they were up in the 86 clothing, uh, you know, their their shirts on the way over there. And then they made it all the way to the art walk. And all this was documented by the homie Wacko right here. You stay tuned for that video. How long till that comes out? I'm probably going to work on it tonight, so. So probably you know you might see it in a year two years maybe at least three no <laughs> no you'll probably see that in a week or two though but the uh the footage from the crew coming here um zion was spinning in the front shout out to dj zion too man he'll be back uh next week i believe dj zion's in the mix uh today we got dj prospect yeah. uh, how was your mother's day bro with mama wacko i was just saying hey, i know mom what are you talking about yeah yeah <laughs> Uh, it was cool, man. Uh, I actually got to see her, and we all just kind of chilled and stuff like that for like about a, about an hour or so, and then I started editing photos. So I'm <laughs> back to work. work. Back yeah, to work. Man, I, took I took the day of off, dog. Chilled with Mom Dukes. We, we went to the yeah. the movies and then came back, barbecued at my pad. It was Ooh, cool. Movie you go my to brothers you? and all that. Uh, Avengers, dog. That shit was dope. Yeah, I wanted dude. to go when it was a little less crowded, but it was a pretty good movie, dog. I liked hey, it. There was a part in the movie that reminded you where like Hulk was beating everything, and there was like the Hulk and the store and then Hulk just goes out like this and shit yeah yeah and then that <laughs> just to show you who would win yeah real quick <laughs> i like when he slammed the one dude loki and just started yeah dog, like ra- like he was a stuffed animal i'm gonna go see <laughs> that shit again though that show's pretty dope man check this out man we're gonna get into this uh 86 commercial and come right dj prospect in the quick mix at the beginning of the show man yes sir Inside show what up What's up, y'all? It's Medusa. Yes, L.A.'s underground most wanted. Where am I? You know, I grew up with vinyl. There's the A side, and then there's the B side. I spun the B side, and I'm at the B side show. Whew, isn't that ironic? I want you to come on in, feel yourself, sit on down, check us out, and make sure you always spin the B side. Hey, and on the B-Side show, that...
bsideshow.net we're cutting in and out here it's part of yeah. our uh, yeah we're trained professionals so we trained. learned to do that we're like ventriloquists for dj real? prospect man taking us back got some jams prospect, in there for real though P plus original joints that yeah. people sampled off of hey that's what it is man we're always trying to teach man we got uh we got bare arms clothing in the building man go ahead and let no, them know who you are man i'm hercules from bare arms clothing tino bare arms clothing Hercules, man, we we were talking. <laughs> Hercules, hey, we were talking off air, and um, I wanted to know, you know, about how 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 you guys started and stuff like that. But start off by letting them know about how long you guys been uh, ha having the the clothing Tell line together. You, you know are. what I'm saying? As far as how long we've been around, it's been roughly about a little over a year. Our actual business license birth date is a uh, 420. Yeah, hey. we, 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 ju we just had a birthday. It's easy to remember. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Or forget. Yeah, or <laughs> <laughs> uh, the homie Penny said, or forget. Right. <laughs> That's what it is. I knew Tino was going to come in here. Let's go. We, we like to clown. Let's go. No, go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead, homie. Go, go ahead. What were you saying? Oh, man. Now, as, as, as far as how we got started, it's something that, that is, this, is my, this is my brother Hector's. Big up to Hector. He's a, he's a founder and father of this. This is, this is his baby that they. That he came up with i mean him actually him and another partner was putting this together and the other partner fell off he just he didn't uh -huh. what, happened with, what happened with your brother though where's uh, he at my, bro my brother's my brother's not the uh the upfront type of guy uh, okay. <laughs> I mean, he's behind the scenes he's, he's behind okay. the scenes okay. I mean, he's, and he's, he's also the one who does all, all who press does all our, our prints Oh, you know nice. what I mean? so like he does them himself. He actually, yeah, we do our own. What? Yeah. So you guys have your like own little set we of have a a screen of print. We actually have now we have an automatic press. Oh, and that's what's nice going. and yeah. expensive. Yes. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. It's expensive. People. <laughs> How much do your understand. shirts run? Um, in store or from us. Well, I mean, tell us both. You know what I'm okay, saying? Well, hey, see, so you can. <laughs> you just heard it. You can get the homie <laughs> discount from the, the B side. Yeah. <laughs> okay, he means the B side hookup. <laughs> that's the Go hookup the right B there. B side right here. <laughs> but um, in stores, they're going anywhere from like 20, 21, 26. I mean, depending. We have about uh, so far we have about about seven different stores, seven, eight different stores. We just landed a couple more in um in East LA. Big ups to C2 Clothing. Big ups Dope. to the Tunnel. I mean, we have a couple in San Bernardino. We have uh. Let me let me give you guys shouts out in the cup boutique in San Bernardino, curb serving in San Bernardino. We have music revolutions in Whittier, made clothing in Whittier, and uh, knapsack clothing in Santa Ana. So damn, you guys are everywhere. Yeah. They're, they're That's right. dope. That's, you got to hustle though. You yes. guys are gonna see this gear everywhere real soon. Oh, actually, we just got some too, man. What? Let me show oh, we did. Oh, cool. We got some B-side blessings. Well, uh, Daisy could wear one as okay. like a so nightgown. This is what I was gonna ask you. Exactly. Da Daisy okay. could wear it as a nightgown at night. Um, so, do you guys have girls' clothes? That we do. You oh. know, did you know there's a girl on this show? Did you know that? <laughs> See, he said that, that, that we do we not. Did you did Personally, not. Personally, okay. no, I didn't. Yeah. No, I didn't. Oh, uh, actually, they gave me a two XL B side shirt, and I had it got I had to go get it cut. She she so made it into her own. She made it work. But she you made know it what? Work. You know what? It's better that way because then your shirt is more original. It is. It's so original. <laughs> there's it's only custom. one in the it's world. It's custom. <laughs> and then all hey, the girls like, "What's Angel from Covert? She cut my Where stuff." Cut that? Hey, hey, Tino. Yeah. I wanted to ask, man, what, what's your role in the whole team? I know he was talking about the. It's a team thing, man. Uh, explain your role a little bit to the peeps. Uh, every event anything that you that we have you're gonna see me there i i bring everything whether it's the shirts the table canopy the everything oh, i do all events work. oh, oh no 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 i'm the, the <laughs> i'm the event man it started okay. like like you know my brother said it started you know with my brother hector and you know me and my other brother rudy we came to him and said hey you know what's up let's start doing this at venice that's that's how actually hey, ev everything got that's started how it, that's how a lot of people start actually is at venice N no joke Venice, I show you love all the time. <laughs> I don't care. Man, Venice is is a spot when it comes to starting something hey, off. First come, first serve too, right? Like you just catch a, a spot. Uh, nah, actually no more. No, not no more. Yeah, now it's permit, they right? have a, they, nah, they have an ordinance. No oh, clothing really? can be sold right there. Unless oh. you have a booth on the other side of the boardwalk. Crazy. That's the Everything's ordinance. Ordinance. Yeah. <laughs> nah, nah, actually huh. what wow. it is is when Venice started, they started it to have artists and performers. Right. So that's what they brought it back to. Now you have actual spots where performers perform and artists show it's their just art. Politics and 
exactly. and trying to keep it yeah, order in order. And you gotta, you gotta, you got. Well, you have to kind of fucking respect that because if it's just gonna get so oversaturated and just flooded with, you know what I mean. So you, you kind of have to coordinate it in a sense. So, That's kind of you know? how it was, you know. In all due respect. You bums in Venice know how to fight. I'm telling you. I'm telling you now. I see yeah. so many fights there because people coming up and trying to take their spot. You know? Yeah. yeah. yeah Crazy dude. stuff. This is my I spot. Like, I'm, I'm, for real. For real. I'm sorry. Venice bums. Uh. Peace out. <laughs> Shout out to you guys if you're in the chat room. <laughs> hey, <Jeez. but laughs> check this out. Um, I wanted to ask the homie Hercules. Um, you mentioned the team. Uh, can you explain um, the team of Bear Arms Clothing and and their roles in individually? I mean, we heard Tino's part, but you know, there's other players involved, right? Yeah. Um. As far as our nucleus, it's uh -huh. first Hector. Like I said, he's the he's the founder and he's also the printer. He's also our, our financial backer. Um. I take care of the sales and marketing. My brother Tino does event and sales. My cousin Carlos over there handles all the street team and promotions. Okay. I mean, so we pretty much got a, a little synergy going. We we have we have our bare arms camp. You know what I mean, we have Pause One, we have TGP, we have Tic Tac Montana, Anthem, the Front Runners. I mean, these are the, uh, well, we have a, a lot of a lot of family. Quick question. So yeah. Who's uh, your designer? Like who designs? Well, your we design? have a few different designers. Matter of fact, uh, Seven Three Three from TGP. He he did a, he did a few of ours. I mean, we're always looking. For, for talent and it just so happens in a lot of industries you'll find a, a saturation of those individuals that are laggers talk about it we want I'm not saying that everyone <laughs> yeah, is yeah. because because that would be wrong of me you know what I mean yeah, but yeah, yeah. a very big handful of them niggas have been laggers but if you are not you hungry and you got something to bring we got something to receive and that's just how we do it if you come to us with something we got something for you i mean you ain't even got to bring something if if if, if you right there if, if you're willing to put in what it takes to be you mean to be around us be with us then then hey you know what it's all love you got me because we don't get paid we still struggling i mean you you might make you might make a dollar here, you might make a dollar there, but yeah, as far yeah. as being able to quit your nine to five, that's not happening for hey, us. You know we I mean? we talked about this off air, man. We're right there with you, dog. It's about because we still we have passion for something greater that's coming. You know what I mean? That's exactly what it is. That's, right? what, it, that's what it is. I know. T go ahead, Tino. You got something to? No, I was gonna say, if any designers out there, hit us up. Tino at Bear Arms Clothing. Hercules, Her Hercules at Bear Arms Clothing, or Hector at Bear Arms Clothing. Telling you, somebody sends this design, like, we'll get back to you. Is that if like dot if it's com, fresh. at Gmail, Twitter, at Gmail. Facebook? At your, your, no, it's dot com. At Gmail? No. At Gmail? It's, it's, if you want to hit me, it's Tino at beararmsclothing.com. Oh, okay. Hercules at beararmsclothing.com. Or beararmsclothing at gmail.com. Yeah. Or go to the site and you can contact us from there too. We're, I don't know, did this question get asked? So, but wh where did the name Bear Arms come from? No, I don't think that was asked. <laughs> We're all talking about everything, but it's like, where, where did the, name where did the nucleus of bare arms? Man, it, it, it starts from your Second Amendment right. First ah. and foremost, ah, you have one. your right to bear arms. And honestly, for us, that was one of our first shirts was the AK-47. Helping people find God since 1947. <laughs> yeah. And, and tell you the truth, my brother speaks a little better than I do, but you know, that that's where it starts. Okay, now as, as as far as bare, bare arms in itself and, and and a meaning, it's it's kind of a multifaceted thing. I mean, bearing your arms is does not necessarily just mean armament. It doesn't have to be a heater. You know what I mean, this DJ he bears his arms when he's on in tables. The MMCs Where? they bear their arms when they gripping the Get mic. It. You know what I mean? You you graph artists. You know what I mean? You you break Ooh. dancers. You know what I mean? All all you niggas who do anything, any of your God given talents or self sharpen and self honed talents, those are your arms. So That's for right. us, bear arm, bearing your arms is something that can be applied to everybody. It's it's pretty much a, it's a perspective or or a state of mind. Because when you bearing your arms, you mean you may may think of a heater, but you mean arming yourself. But that's just a way to convey a thought. That's just a way to convey what it is and how we feel that everyone should feel about their talents and what they got. Damn, that's tell you right. The truth, I like that. That's I right. Like that. I had a blah moment. I was like, bear arm, like 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 they're bare, like open. Like that's what I thought. Like they're just open. open, open. And in, and in, and in terms of <laughs> spelling, you know what I mean? You would think B E A R, you know what I mean? To bear your arms. Like but we we kind of put a little twist on it. You know what I mean? 
showing your arms. That's exactly. right. I like that. That's, That's right. cool. I, 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 I knew there was a twist on it, man. That's what it is. <laughs> and we got some shirts, man. I'm going to sport mine next week on the B-side uh, show. We're going to cut those too because an XL is too Oh, yeah. We, we got to have uh, Daisy cut one up and put one yeah. on. Her Thank you for having girl us. Girl shirt. Oh, man, thanks you know for coming out. <laughs> <laughs> nah, really. Sh- I mean, uh, also, I like to say uh, big ups to, to uh, Brian from Ad Hoc. Big ups to the homeboy Droops from Out the House Productions. I mean, one of the biggest reasons that we... that we wanted to come here was because we have a dead president show that we got coming up May 18th at Malone, Santa Ana. You're be yeah, selling yeah. there? Oh yeah, we got oh, we got yeah. we got we got pre-sale tickets for twenty dollars. Hey, get at them. And, yeah, and yeah, all these please. artists will be there too, man. We're yeah. gonna talk about it throughout the show, but Most shouts definitely. out to Droops, man. He puts yeah. all these Big shows up, together. Sure um, and yeah, he's got dead prez going out there, man. Oh, hey, wh- what's yeah. the spot again? Malone's, right? Malone's in yeah, Santa Ana. That's right, man. You're going to see Dead Prez over there, man. Hip-hop heads come out. Uh, what's the date one more time? And also May 18th. Let them know also um, your guys' contacts and the website one more time, though. Okay, you can reach me at Hercules at BearArmsClothing.com. Get at me if you have any, any type of opportunities or any kind of endeavors that will make both of us smile. <laughs> there it is. I mean, we, 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 we all forgive him, but we also forget him. You I mean, this is a business, and we're trying to move forward. So we can reach one, teach one. We're all for, for a mutual That's growth. Cool so, I mean, if, if, if <laughs> you got something that you a graph artist, you know what I mean, you photographer, you know what I mean, anytime you a promoter, because we're also getting into throwing shows now. Because we're trying to give Dope. back to the culture, you know what I mean? That's, that's what it is, man. That's that's, that's that's where our hearts at. I mean, that's 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 Hip that's our hot. foundation right Hip there. You know what I mean? We hot. b-boys, yeah. we b-boys before we anything. So that's you know what right. mean? that's that's what we're trying to give back. Um, you can get at Tino T E E N O at BearArmsClothing.com and Hercules. By the way, is H E R K. U L E Z. I thought it was with a C. Hercules. Nah, like I said, we, we have a lot of twists on ah, shit. Ah, there you go. There's a meaning to it. Too. Mean, you can also <laughs> check us out at www.bearearmsclothing.com. We have over 20, 20, I think there's 23, 24 designs that are online now. We just recently dropped about, uh, was it 11 or 12 more? Yep. Within the last uh, a couple weeks, we just blessed some of the homies with uh, with a few things that, sure that ain't even in shows so or store excuse me uh, but we'll be at shows oh um, yeah so you, you mean you, all the homies that you see coming up here everybody's gonna be in a different bare arm shirt we, we we're definitely always trying to grow and expand i mean our, our purpose is to bring you you mean is to bring you quality fabrics and innovative designs sometimes graph artists That's get weird. stale so we go with with whoever got that it. is so dope and i will say i love your ponytail it looks really nice i can't make a ponytail that nice <laughs> <laughs> i love that you love it yeah, yeah. It's, really, it's a really nice ponytail it's wait a, really a minute nice wait wait wait, wait. Let, let us stop this train <laughs> did a girl just tell you had a nice ponytail yeah. well it's a braid I, I think a cellmate told you the same <laughs> thing too hey, he took the mic from hey hold, hold on when's the last oh shit. no it's all right yeah. when's yeah. the last time a girl told you, you had anything nice <laughs> You don't see this feed? Hey, can you tell their brothers, Whoa, man? That's what it is. It's shit, my sister. Huh? Stop. <laughs> <laughs> hey, this is Big Mama right here. <laughs> Bear Arms Clothing in the building, man. Oh, Check yeah. this video out. Dedicated right here. We'll come right back that's with right, the homie. Right. Paul Bruno in the building. <laughs> Peace out. What's up? This the General. East Side Up. LBC. Y'all know how it go down on the West Coast. Yeah, on the B side show, motherfucker. Gangsta shit. Yo. Uh, Are we back live? What's going on? We're back live. B side show.net, like we do every Monday. Thank you all for tuning in. And everybody in the chat room talking about tacos and tortas and all that stuff. And nipples man. and we love, that st- <laughs> yep. we love that stuff, man. Shout what up, CI? CI and Sophie, man. Yeah. What up? Hey, check this out. We got the homie. Uh, go, I'll let him introduce himself, man. Go ahead, doggy. I'm the world renowned country music superstar. Pause one. He won. Otherwise known as Pause Uno. He won the yeah. country version of, of American Idol. He won. Just for those that don't know. Plus he raps. I hard. just look this way. <laughs> uh, yeah. I voted for you. Sweet. <laughs> yeah, hey, welcome back too. everybody that's tuned in. Wacko phoned in and everything, man. What you been up to, man, since the last time we seen you? Uh been avoiding California because you know what I mean, like the homie Herc said, 
the shit is like extremely saturated everybody raps everybody does graph everybody tattoos everybody's a fucking model etc etc everybody dj so you know i just like try to move around the country and try to get the fuck out the country at the same time that's what it is you've been all over the place right doing shows and stuff getting the word out it is dope because you get to go and you, you experience different cultures and you get to see like when we go out there they kind of treat us like the lakers you know yeah, like yeah. they know they know how many rings we have they boo you no no they they, 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 they never boo you. i haven't got booed yet you know thank god i appreciate yeah. the love but, <laughs> so bad but right it will it will happen one day because the hate is always there but it's oh, dope because it you see all these different circles and how they interact with each other and how they view us and they got this like this glass between us like we're not real people because we're from southern california or that california so, so you gotta like yeah. break that shit and, like, i, I noticed that when i go to like just to visit my my cousins in arizona man it's like hey my cousin from l.a what like i'm like and i didn't even tell them i rap yet at this point they still want my autograph no i'm just kidding take a picture <laughs> uh, instagram that's you're from, where you yeah, you're from LA. look uh, that's crazy man i want to be like you yeah that's true though because man when i went to chicago and shit man i got fucking mad love it i was just over there dropping my brother off because he was starting school <laughs> and then I, I randomly uh, met this dude he was uh, uh cleaning the pool and i wanted to go hey man is there any hip-hop spots out over here like he goes well, he goes, hey, you're new around here. I was like, no, I'm just here dropping my brother. I'm from L.A. and all that shit. Oh, what? So we were chopping it up. He took him over to his homie's pad. They fucking blazed me out. And then I was like, hey, I got some Cali weed. Nice. And I blazed them out. Sweet. <laughs> That's <laughs> why <laughs> they look up to us so yeah. much. Yeah. Well, hey, Washington, <laughs> honestly, is everywhere I've been. Washington, I'm going to take my hat off to them. They got the best weed so far. Washington? Washington, oh, Washington hey, State. Oh, yeah? I'm a good and girl. They got, they got North, man, so, you know, yeah, yeah. They got dope. They got a dope hip hop scene there too. So, you know, and that's West Coast. Like, if you look at the fuck, that's right. pull out your map, dust it off. Look, this shit is West Coast. So it's not just California. That's West Coast. That's but true, man. It was was true. there any spots while you're out there that like surprise you how how they're riding for hip hop? Like you wouldn't expect it, maybe or Olympia. Olympia is like it's you know it's the it's the capital. But they fucking love that shit. I was walking around downtown Olympia, and they got, like, it's sniped up everywhere. Posters, flyers, and there's a lot of hip-hop shows going on there. And people show up and support, and nobody fights, and there's no drama. There's no bullshit. They just that have an appreciation. Amazing. That's how it should be out here. That, that's why now we understand why he traveled uh, there. So it goes in a circle. It all makes sense now. <laughs> but I'm back home yeah. on a B-side show. <laughs> that's what it is, most man. Yeah, brother, and we yeah. thank you for coming back, man. This guy's been around. We, some of our first shows, he's actually done in-store uh, shows here and everything. Brought little paws with him. You know what I mean? It's like family, man. Hey, um, you got your project out there right now. Can you let them know where they can get that one, the download and if, all that? If you guys, if you guys want to listen to anything... I'm doing just go to SoundCloud slash P A W Z and the number one. You could Google my name, find the videos, YouTube, whatever. Uh, P A W Z and the number one, or you can spell it O N E. Um, I got a few things out there, a couple videos in the works, working on different projects, but I'm here on behalf of Bear Arms. You know, that's the family that I came with. So Bear, Bear Arms, and also uh, we got uh, Greenhouse Projects coming up right now. Yeah. Hey, what we're going to do is have uh, Paz uh, introduce them as soon as we show this video. We're going to show the, uh, this is the one with you and Agala. Sweet. Go, go ahead and introduce Dope. it, though. This track is featuring Killer Ben as well from Gold Chain Military. Salute to him, everybody from family. Um, Song is called New Styles featuring Agala, Killer Ben. Check it out. B side. Vintage 1989. Y'all know what it is. I represent that old school ruthless. Easy E, rest in peace. This the legendary cocaine, known as the most featured artist in the game. King of G Funk, you heard? Kicking it. Ride on B side. We stay on point like Stacey Adams. Where's? Hey, welcome. Yo, guys. we're back so live. Yeah, we're back. Show.net like we do every Monday. Oh, yeah. Yes, sir. We got Paz Uno right yeah. there in the B-Boy stance in the Good. front. Paz. Yeah, do it like, uh. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> there it is, man. Hey, yeah. Paz, go ahead and introduce, man, who we got in the building. I have both the honor and the pleasure of introducing some of the dopest cats that I've heard out of not only the west coast but hip-hop in general dope energy dope live show content everything is bananas they go by the greenhouse projects get with it greenhouse in the building yeah what what 
What up, tell us go. radio show, thank to Pause One. Once again, repping Bear Arms family, Tic Tac Montana, Anthem, and One Front Runners. That's how we do it, it's family right here. You guys want to, yeah, run it down the yeah, line. Yeah, no doubt. Johnny O repping the Greenhouse Projects, Bear Arms family. Shout out to DJ Prospect, the B Side Radio. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Pause yeah. One, keeping it all universal, all one circle. Shout out to everybody in the spot. Yeah, yeah, what up? 733 Greenhouse Projects, man, on this B-Side show. To bring that real hip-hop everywhere we go, guaranteed, man. Good looking out, having us. Bear Arms clothing, of course. We got Spit Savage right here coming up next, man. He's the fucking worst of us all. The dirty, grimiest and shit. <laughs> I don't have to say shit anymore. He just told you, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Greenhouse <laughs> Projects, Bear Arms clothing, in effect. B-Side Radio, thank you for having us, you know what I mean? Straight up and down. He said, grimy like what? What you got to say OGB about that? The crew. That's what it is. That's super grimy right there. This is Big Vicom, Greenhouse Projects. Not victim. It's like victim. like let's go rob those motherfuckers. You know what I'm saying? Brack, brack. Mm. All right, now, let's go ahead and get through the basics real fast here before we got to get into all the other good stuff you guys got coming up and everything like that. How did this form? How did this come about? Basically, the Greenhouse Projects, first and foremost, started as a production team. All out old school off the MPCs. I still busted 2000 with the floppy disk, just like my man Spit Savage. Floppy disk. Yeah. This cat busted two, 2000 XL. Got rich on production as well. We started that way. That was the foundation, that boom bap, that culture hip hop. We don't do that fucking soft ass candy shit. <laughs> represent the fucking kicks and the snares. Dope ass samples. Keep it culture. The original. So it was mostly all production, so you guys are all mostly, like... Yeah, most, yeah, we're all production, but what we did was well, we got tired of the people and the and, and the content of what we were hearing getting submitted to us, and we were like, you know what? We just got to take this from the start to the finish, and we got so, into so, the So basically, the production. basically, they, they were ruining your beats. <laughs> 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 hey, of, yeah. hey, they, they said, you no, know no, what? I'm Let's just do it, this ourselves, nah, man. I'm going to say it. I'm gonna, <laughs> nah, I'll I'm just gonna say it. I'll they, mess around. They, 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 I'm going to say that most people just weren't catching the vision. They weren't catching the total picture. They weren't representing the hip hop roots. And, and what we do is we represent the true MCs, the true production, like that primo shit, raw lyrics. No doubt. Basically, you know what I'm saying? We individual artists to come together, you know what I'm saying? A production crew, we started off. Uh, me, I've been an MC for a minute, man, since 96. Been spitting shit or whatnot. Came together, I met up with the greenhouse. And uh, we know we just started building, man. Again, we started as a production crew. Started rhyming, started laying down tracks, and we just came together, and you know what I'm saying? Individual artists coming together as one, bringing you that that boom bap '90s era type music. You know what I'm saying? Hey, hey, speaking on that though, he mentioned like primo and stuff like that. Do you guys have any any other you know influences in your in your production or or or, or the you know the artistry and, and how you perform, whether it's a rap? Yeah, there's or a lot, but for just that '90s era, you know what I mean? Uh -huh. Not to keep bringing it up, we're bringing it up, but it is what it is. Yeah, you know, yeah. that's when we did it. And it just hasn't been the same since, in yeah, my yeah, opinion. Yeah, you know what I mean? Straight up. You know, and uh, that's how we keep it. You know, I'm trying to try to feed to the seeds the shit that, that we learned. You know what I mean? The culture shit, the real shit, the way it's supposed to be. You know yeah, what I mean? Yeah, 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 and, like yeah. the, the fucking hip hop, the live shit, the fucking get the crowd like what the fuck just happened shit. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. It's a good and a good time at the same time. No drama, no, you know, all that good stuff. Man. The 90s, though, Make me want to crowd surf and uh, shit right? like that. You know what I mean? Yeah, that'd be great. <laughs> <laughs> no, it, do, do you guys do all on the production? You, I mean, uh, I'm sorry, the the, the album you guys got coming out. Um, did you guys do all the production yourself, or do yeah. you guys go outside at all? No, no, we everything that you've heard us on this far is is our production. Okay. Whether, you know what I mean? Everything, yeah, okay. we got they got thousands of beats. Like okay. it's a production team. Uh -huh. You heard it before, but you've seen it now. You know what I mean? Real so, shit. It's like it is what it is. That's the way it started, and the rest just happened. You know what I mean? Okay. With the love and the like. Fuck, let's let's bring it out the way it's supposed to be. Hey, you know, hey, whenever, when, whenever there's a, anybody can answer this one, but whenever there's a production team, dog, like. I always want to know how it how it comes together creatively. Like it could always be different, but does someone like come up with the kick maybe, and then someone nah. come up with the direction, or it's just whatever you're nah, feeling nah, nah. at the moment? Well, you know, we we, we call it a production okay. team, but we okay. all have our own. We, yeah, we, we don't we don't okay. commingle too much on beats. We'll we'll okay. commingle on and, and co-write hooks. We'll, we'll we'll get into ideas and for, formulate it. 
you know you know structures and things like that but the beats come from the individual you know spit savage has his own style yeah, yeah. wicked 733 has his own style wicked jo is ridiculous on the npc and uh and uh, i'm pretty good at that shit too <laughs> it, it's probably crazy <laughs> Hey, it's probably yeah, just a little. Hey, it's probably crazy though when you guys don't see each other for a few days and then you come back and go, oh yeah, peep this one. Huh? Yeah, basically he, that's how it is. He yeah. just fucking slap you in the yeah. face. It's like, look, I got a heater. Get on this shit. We start writing a hook. Roll up a blunt. Get on some shit. Start writing. I go home do your homework and it. come back with it. You know what I'm saying? That's basically what it is. Mm -hmm. That's what it is, man. That's okay. This show's 420 friendly. Hey, ch check this out, man. We're going to get into this. Oh, CI's clip of the week real quick. Shouts out to CIA in the chat room. We're going to get to CI's clip of the week. Come right back with the Greenhouse Project. Yeah. The Project. Start. Bear arms. What's going on, y'all? This is Master Ace. Brooklyn, New York City. EMC is my crew. My new album is called The Falling Season. Produced by the one and only Kick Beats of Los Angeles, California. That's right. Make sure you pick that up and support that. And always tune in to bsideshow.net for the real hip-hop. We're back. Yeah. Bsideshow.net like we always do. Man. You know what it is. DJ Prospect behind the ones and twos. We're going to hear his mix in a little while. We got Greenhouse Projects in the what? building with us right yes, now. Man. Go green, yes, bitches. Yes. Go green. Hey, we, before we Go get green it, for hip-hop, people. Keep it green. I was just going to ask you guys that, man. Go green. So you guys, <laughs> uh, do you guys practice going green? Do you guys... Do uh you know recyclable paper and everything definitely like that. we hit up all the dispensaries. Yes. You know what I'm saying? We go green for hip hop definitely. We don't recycle shit. Yeah. I heard you guys are performing on Earth Day too and everything like that, man. Definitely, you know what I'm saying? Got a That's couple good. shows coming up, you know what I'm saying? May 18th at Malone's. Yeah. Rocking that set with Dead Prayers. Hey. Shout out to Bear Arms in the spot, you know what I'm saying? Helping us promote that shit out the house. Ad hoc, you know what I'm saying? Droops. What up, Droops? Droops. What up? Droops. Droops is the homie, man. Yeah. Also, you guys got another show over in uh, Ontario as well. Yeah, right? out in uh, San Bernardino on the 20th at the uh, Ontario Convention Center. Uh, you know what I'm saying? We're opening up for that Bully Dog show. Most of the people that don't know about the Bully game, you know what I'm saying? It's a big game, definitely. And uh, we're opening up for uh, Dub C on that shit, man. So, you know what I'm saying? It's going to be dope West Coast Day. You're giving me oh, yeah. flashbacks because, uh, you know, my Rottweiler got away. I mean, I'm sorry, my pit bull got away. And, uh, yeah, and, and, and uh, just a quick heads Sad. up on that shit. The convention center pulled the plug on Dub C at that spot for insurance reasons. And uh, Dub C's going to be, we're going to be rocking the after hours with Dub C right after that spot. So the man's trying to stick it to hip hop right there, saying Dub C's too, too uh, gangster for their spot. And uh, kick them out of the venue, but we're gonna make that shit happen anyways. After, so if they have yeah. the ticket for the for the uh, for the bully exactly. show, they get to go see if you, you guys. Got, if you go see that bully show, you got that That's ticket. Right. That ticket's gonna get you into the Dove C after hours. The venue will be real close, real close by. Uh, you know no word on the venue yet. It's kind of underground fucking style. It's gonna be announced uh, in right. a couple days and shit. All but right, yeah, cool, it's gonna cool, be. Cool, cool. It's about five ten minutes away from that spot. Sweet man, that's dope. Dub C sick After man. I want to see that dude. I haven't got to see. Oh, actually, I did uh, with as West Side Connection, but I want to see him do a solo spot too, because I'm I'm pretty sure he's gonna rock uh, uh pay pay the dues. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> exactly. His original shit with the Mad Circle. That's, that's a, what that's it a is. Right there. Hey, low profile right there, that's dog. When, right he, there. when he used to have Coolio as his as his group mate. You know what I'm saying? For those that don't know. Yeah, for sure. Go Google it, motherfucker. <laughs> definitely, definitely <laughs> let you know that. that Everybody want to rap, but they ain't paid dues. They ain't paid dues, and, and Greenhouse does rep that 90s culture, but we also come out of that dope 80s. You know, it wasn't a West Coast thing. It wasn't an East Coast thing. Yeah. You dropped the fucking it was just NWA, fucking hip -hop. The, the, the public enemy shit. You had, like, you everywhere from, yeah, like, public enemy to, like, De La Soul to, like, you know, Word up. special ed, you know what I'm saying? That's right. Hey, in the 80s, like, no one even gave a shit where everybody was coming from. No, you know really. It, it was, was just, like, Exactly. That, that was the thing about the 80s is, is the 80s you had EPMD dropping that funk that you would have thought was coming from West Coast. Yeah, and yeah. And then you had Dre dropping, like, these ridiculous samples with NWA, and that could have very well been from the east coast yeah it, it was just good music at it the time that's where we want to yeah. take it back to and shit yeah man epmd the big payback that should exactly. still be bumping that shit gets plenty of place to yeah yeah hey, no, hey no. any shout outs you guys want to make what we're gonna yeah, do yeah. we're gonna go into the video and then you guys if you guys want to do a track live it's on you but go ahead shout them out man yeah well i actually want to shout out and plug one more thing we got a 
Bear Arms mixtape coming out. We're shooting for uh, July 4th and that shit. It's going to be called the Bear Arms Projects. We definitely got a oh. lot, of, lot of talent on we, that shit. We got that. Yeah. My bad. We got that. You got that prospect queued up? Yeah. You, you guys want to go ahead, go ahead and lead into it. Let's play let's that. This is, the, this is the first single dropped off of that Bear Arms Projects. You got TGP right here representing J.O. Spit Savage 733. You got Vicom on the beat. Brack, brack. Check it. Bear Arms CA all day. That's right, man. Yeah. Hey, what, what was yeah. that project? Uh, I mean, that song off what project? That's the Bear Arms Project the, okay. track right there. Yeah. Go ahead, let them know when July it's 4th? out. July 4th. July oh, 4th. Yeah. The Bear Arms Project mixtape will be dropping. You know what I'm saying? You can cop that shit on there, no doubt, for sure. That's I mean, right, you guys, man. You guys mentioned that the Marines are hardcore and stuff. I mean, the Navy's hardcore, too. I'm in the Navy. I'm, just <laughs> I'm in the Navy. Here we I'm go. <laughs> I heard that. I heard it. You know, they're the, they're the department <laughs> of the Navy. I'm just saying. 
<laughs> She's gonna put her fatigues on right now. You gotta crazy. watch out, man. You know, <laughs> you don't want to snipe some motherfucker right now. Hey, yeah, <laughs> she, she bears arms. Hey, ch- <laughs> check this out, man. We have Greenhouse Project right here. The project. Bear Arms Clothing, man. Pause hey. one. Bear Arms. And we we thank them all for coming through, man. Um, oh, as yeah. we were getting to before, go ahead and make your shout outs. Um, we got your that video too. We'll lead into that in a sec. Go ahead, and make your oh, shout. Oh no out. doubt. Just want to give a shout out to the whole B Side Show. Thank you. You know what I'm saying? Everybody. Yeah. Supporting that real hip hop to the bare arms. Yeah. Shout outs to Droops ad hoc. Shout outs to Retaliation Cap and everybody on this positive hip hop movement. That's right. Yeah, once again, man, good looking out to the B Side Show for having us. You know, we appreciate this shit. Been love since we walked in the door, man. That's where it should be with hip hop. You know hear I me? Mean? Yeah, yeah. And uh, everybody doing the same thing that we're doing just somewhere else. You know, keep it moving, man. It's all love out that West Coast. Greenhouse Projects. West Side. No doubt. Much respect to all the real hip hop heads that supporting and know what they're doing. You know what I mean? This is some fucking real hip hop shit. We bring it. You know what I mean? We don't sing it. <laughs> yo. Yo, Greenhouse Projects is manipulated spelling. T H A A or G E R E E N. I mean H O U S E. Hey, I shouldn't have tried to spell it all drunk, huh? I told y'all motherfuckers. Projects. Yo, it's make sure the K S is it's in the there. end. You know what I mean? Greenhouse Projects. Sure hey, hey, anybody yeah, in the chat room that, is, that spells right? that back, get a shirt. Just, just listen yeah. to what's on the screen. I'm telling you right now. That's how real this shit is. You ain't got to be with anything except hip hop to get with this shit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, but you catch us on SoundCloud too. SoundCloud slash Greenhouse Projects. That's, right. That's, That's Projects P R O J E K S. That's the difference. Oh, and there's yes. a T H A at the. You Google it either way, however, and it'll come up, man. But E K S at the end, and it'll come up. That's right, Greenhouse Projects, man. Once again, Vic and shit. Like to thank B Side Radio, Prospect, Bear Arms, fucking family. We got Pause One in the house. Everybody in LA that's always supported our shit and anybody that does that real true hip hop, we appreciate that shit. We're just as big as fans as we are artists and uh, we want to catch you when you catch us. So catch us in the area. You know, you hear something you like, we want to hear something we like, get at us. That's okay. right. Raw hip hop, some humble shit. dudes, man. Looking get at them for beats too, man. That's what it is. Hey, Peace, go please. ahead. Who wants to lead into the video, man? Yeah, this uh, next video is right here. is produced by my dog Spit Savage. It's called "Listen Up," Spits. featuring yours truly, Johnny O. Spit Savage on that shit. You know the projects. <laughs> yeah, that's right. B side. Yeah. Yo, this is cool. One eighty seven. You know I'm chilling at. I'm in my town. West Covina, you know what I'm saying? I don't want to put y'all up on everything because I always do that because that's how the black Superman, the black godfather do it. You know what I'm saying? I'm chilling at the B-Side shop on the B-Side show. What y'all know about that? Rest in peace to my man KMG and Easy e Tupac. I love y'all. Boom. You know how we do it. Ah! It's all good. I'm just going to say it's all the way live. How much? We're live, bsideshow.net, man. Check this out. Whenever, whenever prospects ready. CD's not loading right. Oh man, (laughs) just drop an instrumental, dog. Check this out. Whatever he's got, man, we're gonna let it crack. Greenhouse Project in the building. Go. We just wanna give a little flavor of what we're trying to do. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's an MC yeah. without a freestyle? Nothing. What's, what's an, an MC without, without a written page? Nothing. What's, what's an, an MC without, without a DJ? Shit. What's, what's an, an MC without a heartbeat? He's incomplete. The definition of an MC is the master of ceremonies, the microphone commander controlling the crowd thoroughly. Not just a rapper with corporate backing and propaganda. Got a grasp of the culture and everything it stands for. Break dancers, DJs, and graph writers, poetry reciters, bringing Peter to the pipers. Beats, bars, hooks, and kush. What we all about, like Johnny. Yo, the greenhouse be turning it out. I'm motivated by those kicks and snares. Yes. Watching cats go from head spins to windmills to flares. Yeah. Rare vinyl rotating on 1200s. Sample searching and of course getting blunted. Blaze it up. A freshly painted freeway wall in heaven. heaven. Memories of the Santa Fe yard right off the 7th street. street. A true MC knows the relevance of his surrounding elements. And, and when, when they, they come, come together, together it's heaven set. And what's an MC without a freestyle? Nothing. And what's an MC without a written page? Nothing. And what's an MC without a DJ? What's an MC without a Yo. heartbeat? He's incomplete. Yo. 
Who's next to die? Hits fly under a gray sky. I strike quickly, didn't even give a chance to ask why. I play the front line, about to take what's mine. Spit savage, one of a kind, hard act to find. I'm so ugly and gruesome, words can't define. I smack the blind, whose world is this? The world is mine. Hey yo, before I was tainted by lust and booze, I was a snotty little boy, I had nothing to lose. Born confused, used to mob around with my crew. I had bodies trying to do the same shit that I do. It's been a little long while, ain't nothing new. Cracking twos and cracking blues, a greenhouse project straight smacking fools. Another one bites the dust, walking with us. Some betrayed for the lust, thought he was a homie who can you trust. Motherfuckers know this when I'm at a flow pit. TGP banging crazy. Yo, now what's an, what's an MC without a freestyle? Yo, nothing. And what's an MC without, without a written page? Nothing. nothing. And what's an MC without, without a DJ? He ain't shit. What's an MC without uh, a hard beat? Yo, he's incomplete. Now realistically, I rhyme critically. Uh, the epitome of a dope MC. MC. Make it hard to get rid of me. Uh, I strike vigorously, deliberately. For those who don't know, it got skills and I'ma show it. Uh, it's just confirmed. I've been devoted as a, a deadly, deadly poet. poet. My flow's potent slash lethal. Incognito. I'm passionate like Jesucristo. I was sent here to finish uh, y'all. Listen to the Minutes, uh, y'all. Deep with this hill in it, y'all. Listen close to when we spit at y'all. Correctly intercept me. Otherwise, forget me. My diaries inspiring, retiring, vets, G. Brilliant defiance, forming alliance. Strike like lightning when I'm writing. Yes, you know that I'm exciting. My heart is half lying, half tighted. Continuously rhyming on the way to the top. Picture me climbing. What is it? Yes, I'm not stupendous when I rhyme. Now, what's an MC without a freestyle? Nothing. And what's an MC without a written page? Nothing. And what's an MC without a DJ? What's an MC? With the hard beat, he's in complete. What's an MC without a freestyle? Nothing. And what's an MC without a written page? Nothing. And what's an MC without a, a DJ? He ain't shit. He what's ain't an shit. MC without a hard beat? He's, he's incomplete. Uh, he's incomplete. Incomplete. The Greenhouse Peace Project. Peace Just Peace wanna Peace give you a little bit of flavor, kind of what we trying to do. Yeah. Shout out to everybody. That's off the whip shit. Yeah. You know yeah. how we do. Bsideshow.net. Nah, I mean, bringing that real hip hop, y'all. Yeah. Greenhouse real projects hip-hop. in the building, <laughs> man. One more time, B side, make some noise for Greenhouse. <laughs> hey, we need some. TGP. This mic fucking sucks right here. Bear Arms. There we go. Bear Arms clothing in the building. Greenhouse projects, <laughs> man. That's what it is. Thank you guys. Pause one for coming through. Um, hip hop, like we always do. Thank everybody that's in the chat room. DJ Prospect, we're about to let him go in the mix. Hey, you guys got to let them know the links to get your uh, material one more time. Go ahead, go ahead, dog. Let them know. And the yeah, SoundCloud. SoundCloud. <laughs> fucking slash Greenhouse Projects. P R O J E K S. Google it, man. It's the easiest fucking way. It's so, you know, Google with the E K S at the end. There's videos on there. Fucking. The YouTube, got YouTube, the SoundCloud, all that good reverb, all that good stuff. Facebook, Google it. And also, all the way live, let them know about the show one more time with the Dead Prez. Yeah, your Dead Prez, man. Yeah, looking forward to that shit. May 18th at Malone's, Droops, out the house, and then Ad Hoc. And then on the 20th, we in Ontario at the convention center, man. There's a spot. For the right bully show, Bob C with the bully show. Hell yeah, we with the dogs. Take yourself a puppy home and then go check Bruh. them out live yeah. with Dub C Hell after yeah. that. You know what I'm saying? Hey, yeah. that's what it is. Everywhere we're getting it out, man. Greenhouse projects, man. Side Shout show. out to Net. Droops, Droops too. Bare arms. That's right, bare arms clothing in here, man. Pause one, Mr. Shit on your Pause porch is in the building. <laughs> and shout out to Rock, man. Pause we got one. Silly in here, Cholanda, man. We're partying big. It's B Side Show. We're gonna get into this video and come right back with DJ Prospect in the mix. Whoa. Go ahead, Drek. B Side. Yeah, anyone. Yo, yo, Afro, all flows reach out. AFRO, we was up here in B Side Show. That's what we was doing, we was kicking it. I was just here for the 300th episode. Did the thing, you know, just kicking with some good folk. You know what I mean? So just tune in every single Monday. It's about right. Bye, bro. And I want to shout out everybody in the chat room once again. Thank you guys for always being here, tuning in. Make sure you tell some people about us. Hey, uh, shout out to everybody who came through, too. But we got DJ Prospect about to go in the mix. Yo, what up, dog? What's cracking? Hey, you got your production cracking, right? That's right. That's what it is, man. Can you guys, can you give them the link so anybody that needs to get production can get at yeah, you? I'm all over SoundCloud. Just type in DJ Prospect with a K and shit. And uh, hit me up on Facebook, DJ Prospect. Uh, follow me on Twitter, at DJ Prospect. Just hit me up and, you know, we can collab and stuff. And, you know, hey, wh- on some wh- beats. what's the beat, uh, the production uh, called? 
Uh, it's Dead Beats. There it is, man. Dead Beats, man. It's name my label and shit. That's it. Dead Beats, man. Get a prospect, man. If you want to get some some hot beats, or you know, he's also DJing right. around wherever the hip hop's happening. That's what it is. Yeah, yeah. You know what you're gonna get into in the mix, dog? Uh, I'm probably gonna do some funk, man. I'm about. I'm feeling some, you know, some b-boy shit. Okay, there it is, man. That's what it is, man. Get at DJ Prospect, and I want to thank him once again for coming through, man. That's one of the homies. He comes through and DJs for us just because he loves to DJ, man. That's what it is. And uh, shouts out to Greenhouse Projects. Droops out there. Hope you're in the chat. Zion, I think Zion's in the chat room. What up, Zion? CI, Sophie, uh, who else? Uh, Pause One, everybody that came through, man. Uh, Bare Arms Clothing also. B-Side Show.net. Prospect in the mix. Thank you. 